Welcome back Shell Squad. We have both Groot and Frodo back again and I have a surprise visit a uh, pet turtle and I'm going to show you guys a, a reveal so stay tuned for that but if you're here trying to get the answer to the last video um, I'll put another picture in here now um, and I, what I want you to do is see if you can find any animal or animals in the picture and so here you go. If you pause the video if you haven't found the animals yet, but if you have, here are the answers right here. And thank you for playing. Um, I asked people to comment either crickets or mealworms. I didn't really get any comments saying either one, so I'm gonna go, and, and to be honest, it's, I'm kind of glad because I got these freeze-dried little grasshopper dudes, but here I'm gonna show in the camera. Look at look at the difference. They're just so big. I'm not sure what's gonna happen there. Not much activity. And that's the end of the video. <laughs> Last time I learned we can wake these guys up a little bit. If we go ahead and Drop some of these suckers. Red wigglers. Let's see. Let's see. One for you. Please don't fight. It's one for you. Let's see what you guys are gonna do. Oh, uh, to spice things up, I have them in water this time. Uh, I've seen a lot of people that also keep these that feed them in water because they're supposed to be a little easier to feed them. So I'm gonna try that this time. I'm not throwing some reptiman pellets. Okay, just for kicks, these are some pre-soaked Missouri pellets too. But I'm pretty sure they're just gonna go for whatever is moving. I guess I'll use my tongs to help wake them up. They're looking at my tongs, they're not looking in the water. Here you go, buddy. Here you go. Oh my gosh, what do I got there? It's like, I like two worms right there. Oh, you're gonna have to come out. There you go, find it. Hey, come out, buddy. Come on out, buddy. You can do it. Look, this guy, He's not eating in the water. Let's see if he's looking at my tongs. Follow the tongue. Yep, he wants the one in the tongue. There you go. All right, good job, group. Let's see, I'm gonna see if I can get some cool third party footage here. Oh man, how cool does that look on camera? <laughs> You're watching him eat like in two screens. Wiggler's putting up a fight, but the Spangleri turtle is winning. Now he looks like he's got the venom tongue. <laughs> and that's down. All right, let's see if he eats a uh, Oh, there he goes. He can. He's seeing them. He's seeing them move. Come on. I know you see it moving in the water. Well, I think the water idea needs a little more work. They need to practice. There you go. You want this? Then eat it in the water. Eat it in the water. There you go. You see it. He's looking. He definitely sees it. Come on. Come on, buddy, bud. Come on, Mr. Groot. Here, I'm gonna grab this guy. Here, you want this instead? Some of the wrap them in? I guess so. <laughs> Is 
because they're still they're still babies. They like to be they like to be fed like little birds. <laughs> this is a pretty big pellet here. Um, let's see if let's see what happens here. Oh, is he gonna get it? Eat in the water. Come on. I'm not sure. I'm gonna distract him with some more food. Bam! Woo. That's a big old pellet for this guy to chew down. <laughs> and we got a getaway worm up on the wall here. I actually did this before in their regular setup that they have, and they did well. But it wasn't quite this deep, and it and it was their you know their home, so. I think they're more comfortable that way. Let's see here. Okay, you want this guy? Come on, eat in the water. Ooh, yes, there we go. There's a water feed right there. I'll put some of these other little turtle sticks that look like, look like worms, little worms. I get a nice little up close footage for you again. Go ahead. Scarf the down. Well, that was fast. Nice and neat. Nice and neat. You got a worm crawling on you, dude. There's a worm crawling on you. There's a worm on you. Let's see what we can do here. Here's a worm. Here's a wormy worm. There you go. Come on, go for it. It's in here. In the water. In the water. Down here. Yes. Get it. Ooh. Love it when dinosaurs feast. Looks like Frodo's starting to come out of his, uh, Frodo's starting to come out of his shell now. Thank you, Frodo, for showing up to the smorgasbord party. I'm trying to have a holiday feast here. Come on. Come on. He loves it. Okay, let go of my dog. Thank you. I don't know if you can see um, Frodo there. He's got one eye sticking out like this. He's getting ready. <laughs> he's watching those worms, I think. Oh, look, now he's coming out. Let me see if I can get him something. I'll move slow. Let's go like, here you go. Ooh, wait, you saw it. Come on, you know you saw it. I know what's happening. Here we go, come on. Start, I'm gonna squeeze the worm, make it squiggle around a little more. Come on. I know you see it. There. I know you see it. Go for it. It doesn't bite. It just wiggles. You're safe, I promise. Eat it. Eat it. The worm just slapped him on the chin. <laughs> wow, strange. I'm just too nervous. Here, let's do some more, more food here. Here's some mezurai. You want that? Hmm? You waiting for me to feed you? Good job, man. Good job. One day you'll grow into a big turtle and you'll be king of all you see.
everything you see in your little tank anyways. Come on, grab it. Grab it, do us a favor. Do it for the kids, do it for the kids watching. So I do wanna say these turtles eat a lot better in their home. Uh, when I try to set up all these lights and you know, lack of hiding areas and stuff, they, <laughs> they're much more shy for sure. Who wants it? You want it? Yes, you always want it. Huh, Groot? You always want it. I don't know if you guys can notice, but or if you guys can tell, but Groot has like a bunch of the shell part that's growing out is really light in color. I'm not sure what that is, uh, but Groot definitely has grown a little bit faster than Frodo. Anyways, let's see if he'll eat one of these. Here, you know what this is. You want this? Hey, here, dude. Dude, you want this? Dude. Dude. You want this, group? Wait a minute. Make you come over here. Oops, sorry. There you go. Come on, Groo. Yikes. Awesome. Uh, you can see that right there. He's actually eating like from the surface of the water, which is great. Let me see if I get a fresh worm here. Oh, I got two, look at that. Double the wiggle action, come on, you want it? Come on, you got a worm on your shell, dude. All right, Groot, go for it. Go for it, Groot, go for it. <laughs> I always love it when the worm wiggles its tail and touches the turtle's eye. Turtles don't seem to mind. I'd run away. <laughs> I might have to do the feed for Mr. Frodo here separately. All right, so I think I'm gonna finish that one right there. Um, now for a special guest. All right, but this is one of my spotted turtles. Like most of my turtles, this guy has no name or girl because I have no idea what the sex is. So I don't name them, I just call them dude. I say, hey, what's up, dude? So I'm gonna try some tongs. I don't feed him with tongs, I just throw stuff in the water. Uh, he actually, or she, I don't know, just ate. So I don't expect much. Just an intro. I can start doing live feeds with this turtle if you like. <laughs> the turtle's like, what the heck's going on? <laughs> Welcome to the welcome to the grand stage, dude. All right. On that note, Grace, who was here on the last video you saw, and she's actually might be doing a guest appearance in the future. She wanted to give this away to one of the viewers. So, if any of you guys are into iPhones, this is an iPhone case for the six plus. Show that down here. Coffee is bay. If you guys know any, it's a girl case, so you gotta know somebody at least that has a, a girl that's a, you know, can use a case like this. But anyways, if, if you want it, here's how you get it. Uh, what you gotta do is comment below and you have to answer. <laughs> if a turtle's under the ice, how does it breathe while it's trapped under ice? 
this recently came up at <laughs> at work. So um, if you can answer that, then I will um, I'll be the first one to answer that, and I'll I'll, I'll send this to you. Okay. Uh, hopefully you can use it. Uh, it's kind of a. Anyways, if you know if this guy this this is here, take a look at the bottom. This is a spotted turtle. If you know if this is a male or female, let me know. I'm told it's too young to tell, uh, but I think it's gonna stay a female. But someone's saying, if you look at the mouth, let me see if I can focus in there. If you look at the mouth, it looks like it might be turning male. And I, I, don't, I don't see it, but I don't know. And I don't see any, you know, thing going concave here. No, it's, like it's gonna stay flat so if anybody knows how to tell if this is a male or female speak now and help us out all right all right shell squad well thanks for tuning in uh, thanks for watching stay tuned for the next video uh, Merry Christmas Happy New Year and I hope uh, hope you're doing well so cheers and see you in the next one